Can you help me out? I need to get some footage of this kid and my camera's busted. He's risking his life on this line, so don't blow it. Hello everyone, Silent here with uh, one of the easiest goals in Tony Hawk's Underground. There are two goals like this, uh, where you just have to stay close and film the guy. You know, just basically just look at them. Oh, we jumped and did nothing. Oh, jumped into a grind. What will we do next? Oh, the shuffling! Can't handle it, it's blowing my mind, man! Whoa! I wish I was this killed, holy fuck. What is he gonna do next? Oh my god, the swirl fucker move. Oh man, into the incestuous nun maneuver. Oh man, that was too insane. Put that in a montage. Check out my buddy's sick line here at the banks. Bet you can't hit it in a combo. Alrighty, time to show off our little magic skateboarding skills by stealing someone's line and trying to perfect it in a combo. Just like before, if you really need to, you can use combo runouts. Shut up, guy with pink hat. I'll deal with you later. Dude, you gotta help me ditch this beater. Ride's faulty and I need the insurance money to score some new kicks. Should be easy. Just maintain speed and this joke will overheat and catch fire. Then ditch it in the river. <laughs> you silly sneakerheads and your harebrained schemes. Huh. Well, um, you know what? I, I basically just drive up and down the road in a straight line. And then when I get close to the end, I do a handbrake and spin the car around, drive the other way. Uh, and I keep doing that until it catches fire. Uh, eventually smoke starts, you know, coming up from the, uh, the hood of the car. So it sort of, sort of masks your, uh, your vision. Um, but you can look to the left and the right of the car. And eventually you have to drive it off a ramp into the river like you said. Oh, I'm sorry, into the river. Um, anyways, I'm just going to speed it up a little bit until the end. Help me out, and I'll help you get some killer footage for Stacy. Rumor has it the inside of this building has some sick terrain. The guards are tough, but I heard they like hot steaming nuts. Get some nuts from the vendors and bring them back to the guards before they get cold. Huh. <laughs> that's... That's really clever. Man, there's more of that way you can only come to expect from the writers of this game. <laughs> guards, man. They just love their hot steaming nuts. Right in and around their mouths. You know, if I even think the jokes are lame, then there's a problem. There's a there's a big problem there. To be honest, I don't know if I can finish this commentary. I feel a little nauseous right now because of the lowbrow humor and the kiss music in the background. Why uh, rock and roll? Uh, no. Oh god, I hate that. I'm sorry. I am just not a Kiss fan, but uh, anyways, just gotta follow the arrow indicator, do what that pink-hatted scoundrel said, and get those guards what they desire. What's you say? We just go with the guards. Now we can get in there any time we want. Check this. You can create your own tricks. I made up the New York Nutbuster. Get special and blast the Nutbuster on one of these windows. So, build up your meter, stand on that one ledge, and, you know, just skate right out the window when you're ready, do the button combination, and you should be just fine. Uh, and honestly, this is one of the reasons why I got this game, is because I saw in the trailer that they are going to have to create a trick, and I was so hyped for that. That was an awesome addition. Oh, I have a couple ideas how I can make this better. Hmm.
Sorry about that, guys. I got a little carried away. My bad. So wait, you're not going to put out that taxi that's on fire, and not only that, you're daring your best friend to trick over it, potentially harm himself, just for a skateboarding video? Two dish bag points. Bang bang. But anyways, here's a little trick I use, guys. Uh, you only really have to jump over the car once. As long as you keep car hop and little combo chain at the bottom there, you'll be fine. You can do tricks wherever you want, and uh, it's really helpful. One thing I didn't like to do was a flamingo, which I guess my controller felt I was doing the motion for it, but it's not what I wanted. Now I'm just expecting a flood of, Oh, Silas just making excuses because he sucks. Jerks. Hey man, I got the video you sent me. Wow, you got style. You are on the team, dude. You're definitely on the team. We gotta find a way to get you down to the Tampa Ann contest. Tampa? That would be insane. But I have like three bucks to my name. Don't matter, man. I'll tell you what. You run some errands for me in New York, and I'll pull you my vintage bus for the trip. Now tell me what you want to ride, and I'll send you all the free gear you need for the event, dude. Alright, so finally we get the uh, first glance of the skate shop where we can change our deck, wheel color, and grip tape. And uh, finally impress Peralta, who sounds a little bit like a stoner. Hey, man. Uh, but anyways, I noticed some shameless advertising, and uh, there, there will be a little bit more later on, but I noticed the Motorola logo on the little phone booth. Um, but enough about that. Next video, we are going to try and obtain some form of transportation by doing a couple things for Stacy Peralta, so we can hopefully go to Tampa and uh, enter the amateur skateboarding contest, maybe even gain some recognition that we so greatly deserve. But anyways, this has been Silent Laws, and I'll see you guys next time.